A NASA task force is holding its first meeting on UFOs, public meeting, I should say. He had a big head and big black eyes and was dressed in a black bodysuit. Are we alone in the universe? This is probably one of the most asked questions in the world. And it's all because of some past encounters and experiences with creatures that look and act nothing like us. But most times, these stories get ignored for lack of evidence making us doubt the existence of aliens. Well, it seems we are not alone in the universe after all, as we now have 20 alien and UFO evidence and encounters that can no longer be ignored. Number 20. Washington, D.C. Flap. Let's start with the incident that happened at the powerhouse. The White House, of course. But before we get there, let's take a step backward to where it all started. It was just before midnight on July 19, 1952, at the Washington National Airport, now known as the Ronald Reagan Washington National Airport, when an air traffic controller spotted seven unidentified flying objects in the sky southwest of the nation's capital. The traffic controller named Edward Nugent wasn't sure if what he saw was not a result of a glitch. He had to ask his colleagues to double-check, and when they told him the equipment was working properly and that the radar could also detect unidentified flying objects, he knew the UFOs were real. Not long after, the controllers could see some bright objects hovering over the White House and the Capitol building. Fighter jets were deployed to the area, but before they arrived, the UFOs had disappeared. It was as if the UFOs could intercept and understand radio traffic as they immediately came back as soon as the fighter jets left. The mysterious objects kept disappearing and reappearing till they were no longer visible by daybreak. But the following weekend, they reappeared at the same spot. After two consecutive weekends of UFO activity over the city, the Air Force held a press conference at the Pentagon to explain the phenomena to the public. Air Force Major General John Samford told the gathered reporters that the air traffic controllers must have seen stars, meteors, and other optical illusions. As meteorological or electronic phenomena. As for the radar, the general said it malfunctioned as a result of temperature inversion. That would have been the end of the story, but Captain Edward Ruppelt was not briefed before the press conference. He later publicly debunked the claims of the general by saying what happened in Washington, D.C. was not related to an inversion. So were they truly trying to cover up the fact that aliens are real? Number 19. The Aerial School Phenomenon It's so easy to label one person a liar when they give an account of their experience when no one else was around. But what do we say about not one, not two, but 62 people giving a similar account of an incident at the same time? Back in September 1994, in a tiny community of Ruwa in Zimbabwe, 62 children at a school called Ariel reported seeing flying silver discs land in a nearby field. It happened when the teachers were all inside, probably on break or having a meeting. The kids claimed that mysterious creatures emerged from the discs and spoke to them through their minds like a form of telepathy. The children described the creatures as human-like with waxy skin and large, penetrating eyes. He had a big head and big black eyes and was dressed in a black bodysuit. At first, the adults didn't believe the children's claims, but soon UFO experts took interest in the case and went to the school to question the children about their experience. They all have very similar accounts of what they saw and also provided similar sketches of the discs and the creatures. One would have thought these kids cooked up this story. But when you consider that they lived in a rural environment where they were not privileged to see depictions of aliens on TV or in movies, you just can't ignore this evidence. Number 18. Quebec's Phenomenal Fiery UFO This UFO is nothing like the world has seen before. A resident of Quebec named Jay Belhowski filmed this UFO on his phone when he was taking out his garbage. He suddenly noticed a bright object glowing in the sky, and suddenly it started to change its shape. That's not all. The mysterious object looked like it was on fire or emitting some sort of energy. At first, when Jay released the video, many people speculated it was a hoax. But after video experts scrutinized the video and said it was real, it changed everything. Jay can be heard saying, it's a ship, while his children are gasping and also saying it changed color. When you look at the object from the video, 
You just can't tell what it was because it's different from what we have seen in movies and TV. There are a lot of questions that will probably not be answered. Number 17. Curious Case of Kelly Hopkinsville Encounter This UFO encounter is a scary yet mysterious one, a tale that hasn't been forgotten even after 68 years. It all happened with two families, a total of 11 people, coming together to have family time on August 21, 1955. They were all around their farmhouse in the village of Kelly when one of them stood up to get some water from the well. When he fit back, he told the rest he had just seen something mysterious in the sky. Others didn't believe him, but soon they saw evidence as they received uninvited guests at the farmhouse. The house was attacked by several small, weird-looking humanoids. After a two-hour gun battle, the two families got in their cars and zoomed off to the police department. But when the police got to the house, they were already gone. However, after the police left, the mysterious creatures came back and continued to attack the residents of the farmhouse. Since then, there's been different explanations with so many people saying the creatures were owls. But why would 11 people fail to recognize owls? Number 16. U.S. Navy Confirmation You must know how much the government hates to admit that aliens exist even with so many occurrences that say they do. But sometime between 2007 and 2017, videos of the U.S. Navy showing unidentified objects flying at high speeds in the Earth's atmosphere were leaked. In the video, the Navy pilots were heard expressing shock and awe while they were looking at the UFOs. The videos were taken during training flights, and the 2017 leaks were published by the New York Times. But even with that, they had something to say. Mundane, skeptical explanations include instrument or software malfunction, anomaly or artifact, and human observational illusion. For example, parallax or interpretive error. Do you even believe that? Number 15. Google Maps UFO When trying to find out ways, we all have asked Google Maps for help at one time or the other. But when a woman asked Google Maps for directions to visit her aunt in Jacksonville, she got the surprise of her life instead. Right on Google Maps, there's an image of a strange floating object. And the mysterious thing about this is that when the city's residents visited the spot, they didn't see anything. Also, whenever they checked for the location on the map, the image always appeared. No one knows what it is, and even Google has failed to give us an explanation. Number 14. Giant Sky Telescope when looking for answers about UFOs, the Chinese might just be our go-to people. China's science ministry reported that the world's largest telescope, known as the Sky Eye, found a signal that could be from alien civilizations. The narrowband electromagnetic signals detected by Sky Eye were different from previous ones captured, and the team further investigated them. After a series of investigations, they were still unable to answer whether it was truly from the aliens or whether they were trying to communicate with humans or not. Number 13. A Rubber Duck UFO This is another evidence that aliens might truly exist. An hour-long video was filmed by an RC-26 surveillance aircraft being flown by Department of Homeland Security, DHS agents, hunting drug smugglers in Tucson, Arizona, back in 2019. About 20 minutes into the footage, an UFO which appears to be shaped like a rubber duck comes racing into view. This mysterious object was seen changing its speed and direction as it moved between 90 and 200 meters per hour. For the rest of the video, the object is still in view, but it's unclear if the strange shape is one object or two flying alongside each other. Number 12. Roswell UFO Incident While the world was worrying about war, Sometime between mid-June and early July 1947, rancher W.W. Brazell found the wreckage. It was discovered on his sizable property in Lincoln County, New Mexico, approximately 75 miles north of Roswell. Because of the popular news of flying saucers, Brazell believed the wreckage might be something similar to the stories on the news. He took some of the materials he found in the wreckage to Sheriff George Wilcox of Roswell, who in turn brought it to the attention of Colonel William Blanchard, the commanding officer of the Roswell Army Airfield, RADAF. Surprisingly, the U.S. Army officials stated that the found debris was actually from a weather balloon, releasing photographs of Major Marcel posing with pieces of the supposed weather balloon debris as proof. 
Another questionable theory was that it was an unconventional plan to induce widespread American panic implemented by the Russians. Number 11. Manitoba Alien Sighting Let's take a trip to Manitoba, a place where news of UFO sightings is very common. But this particular one was encountered by Stephen McCallick, a resident of River Heights, Winnipeg. He worked as an industrial mechanic and was also an amateur geologist who frequently searched for quartz and silver. One day, while inspecting a quartz vein embedded within the Canadian shield strata, Michalak claimed he was startled by the sounds of a flock of geese who were agitated by an object. And as he looked up, he saw two objects which he described as cigarette-shaped with humps in the middle hovering around. One of the objects flew away while the other one landed on a nearby rock. Michalak took his time to observe the craft and sketched it before he decided to approach the craft. He didn't find anything around the craft, but noticed that the craft had an open door which revealed bright lights. He also heard human-like voices, and he tried to communicate with them in different languages, but there was no response. Michalak touched the craft and found out it was so hot that the fingertips of his gloves melted. As he tried to move closer to the craft, it emitted a blast of heated gas which hit him in the chest, blew him backward, and set fire to his clothing. Michalak was found with that burn in his chest, but many believed he was probably hallucinating. Maybe a burn on the chest was not enough evidence. Number 10. UFO in Medellin, Colombia. You must have seen so many videos of UFOs, but I bet none can be as good as this one. This video of a UFO in Colombia was labeled the best UFO footage ever on social media after it went viral. It was captured by pilot Arteaga while flying a plane showing a strange dark object flying towards the camera. At first, the object was vague, but it became clearer as the plane got closer. The funniest part of this story is people raising their doubts about it being a UFO. Isn't a UFO a flying object that cannot be immediately explained or identified? Or was the object seen walking on land? Number 9. Wow Signal A strange radio signal appeared on the night of August 15, 1977, when it was picked up by the Big Ear Radio Telescope at Ohio State University. It got its wow signal name because of how surprising it was. It was very loud and lasted for 72 seconds. It was also a narrow bandwidth signal covering a small range of frequencies similar to artificial signals. Once the signal appeared, it was never repeated, and every attempt to find it was fruitless. Just one explanation came to mind, proof that aliens exist. But in later years, astronomers claimed that the signal was generated from a comet and not a sign of extraterrestrial life. Number 8. UFO caught on live news. As days go by and evidence of aliens' existence keeps surfacing, you wonder if the aliens are the ones trying so hard to prove their existence. This UFO seemed like it knew the perfect time to fly. In June 2018, during the weather broadcast, the Buffalo weatherman, Andy Parker, saw a strange move of light while he was live. But guess what people said? That was a shooting star. But if you look at the direction of the UFO, you'd know there's no way a shooting star would move the way it did. Number 7. Utah Monolith Amid our uncertainties about aliens, a three-sided mystery metal structure surfaced in Utah, providing hope for different beliefs. Everyone who knew about it wondered how it got there and how long it had been around. As dozens of theories trooped in, the authorities decided to keep everything about it confidential, but it didn't take time for people to find its location. But before we could find out anything about the monolith, it disappeared ten days after discovery. Though it was said to have been stolen by a group of employees counting sheep from the helicopter, we still don't know its origin and its whereabouts. Number 6. The Face on the Mars On July 25, 1976, the Viking 1 mission sent back photos it had captured from space, and when they were analyzed, they showed an image of a pile of rocks that greatly resembled a human face. The images were captured in the Cydonia region, and they just looked kind of funny and eerie at the same time. Some people believe that the faces are remnants of alien civilization and that the spot might have been inhabited by them in the past. However, NASA didn't waste time to clarify the situation, as they claimed that the face was created by tricks of light and shadows. What do you believe? Number 5. 
Japan Airlines Flight 1628. There's no other way to describe this occurrence than these pilots played tag in the skies. You see, it was unintended. Japan Airlines Captain Kenju Tarauchi was assigned to fly the plane from Paris to Tokyo, which was what he did. But not long after the plane was mid-air, Captain Tarauchi, sitting on the left side of the cockpit, saw unidentified lights out his side window to the left and below. He ignored the lights because he thought they were military planes. But a few minutes later, he realized that they were unidentified crafts that were pacing him. There was no record of other aircraft in the location at the time, which means no other human apart from those on the plane was aware of the craft. After the UFOs were done playing tag with the pilots, they disappeared with great speed. And till today, no one can explain what happened with Flight 1628. Number 4. Atacama Skeleton This mysterious skeleton was found in 2003 in a deserted Chilean town in the Atacama Desert. The location is the reason why the skeleton was named Atacama Skeleton and shortened to Ada. It is 15 centimeters long and looks like a human skeleton. But how can a human skeleton be that small? This is what led to different speculation about this skeleton, with many people saying it belonged to an alien. However, after the scientists analyzed the skeleton, they claimed it belonged to a premature human fetus. It sure looks more alien than human. Number 3. 1997 Phoenix Lights in 1997, during a high school football game in Scottsdale near Phoenix, four bright lights were seen by hundreds of people and recorded by just two of them. The strange lights moved slowly and blinked randomly. The entire sighting lasted for about a minute and a half, after which several explanations began pouring in to explain the mysterious lights. Some said they were camera lens flares, while some said they were helicopter lights. But of course, the most favored explanation was spacecraft. Amidst all, some believed that the lights were skydivers with flares. Wouldn't anyone know about skydivers coming to the place that night? Or was it all a hoax? Number 2. Southern Florida UFO In February 2021, a man named Eck would have expected his day to end as it started, but as he was driving home in southern Florida near Stewart, he noticed something that took his eyes off the road. It was a UFO in the sky. The UFO looked so strange that he had to record it on his phone. As soon as the object appeared, it started to change in size until it broke apart, leaving what looked like fumes behind. A quick question, if you were Eck, would you have remembered to record this occurrence or be too shocked to hold a phone? Number 1. Nazca Lines Lastly, we have the Nazca Lines. The lines have been a subject of mystery for more than 80 years. The lines look beautifully drawn to take the shape of geometric designs like rectangles, triangles, and so on. While some take the shape of animals like a hummingbird, a spider, or a monkey. Judging by how long these lines have existed, you can't help but ask questions about how they were formed and the purpose they served. Unfortunately, we have no answers to these questions. All we know is they are found in a region of Peru, and they've existed way before humans know these things. That brings us to the final question. Were aliens involved? Thanks for watching. While you are here, click the video on the screen to watch more amazing content.